Okay, let's talk about the injection pump. Okay, we have to overhaul this one. Uh, we already uh, 5,000 running hours. But I will explain to you what is the injection pump. Uh, the injection pump is a device that the pumps fuel into the cylinder of the diesel engine. Traditionally, the injection pump was driven indirectly from the crankshaft by gears, chains, or a tot belt. Often, the timing belt that also drive the crankshaft. Uh, they have a four function of diesel injection pump. Fuel injection pump, pressurized fuel to high pressure. High pressure pipe, same fuel to the injection nozzle. Injection nozzle, inject the fuel into the cylinder. Feed pump, sucking or suck fuel from the fuel tank. Fuel filter, is to filtrate the fuel if uh if you send the fuel or very little pour fuel oil or convert and uh, when you're stopping the engine using the ls mgo low sulfur marine gas diesel oil okay uh, during overhauling fuel pump overhauling before overhauling clean the outer surface of the fuel pump clamp the fuel pump in the pin vise and Remove the delivery valve holder. Take out the delivery valve. Invert the farm. Depress the plunger guide and take out the stop ring. Take out the plunger guide. Now I'm taking out the deflector. We have a port and starboard deflector, so I have to take out that one. Checking the inspection. Okay, in the other side. I have to take out also. This one, it don't forget to foot the for marking so that if you put back and uh, this fuel pump, it will not be interchanged the position.
Alright, this is the overhauled, overhauled fuel pump number 5, unit number 5. So, this is the parts. Now, we have to clean all parts of the fuel pump using the diesel oil. After cleaning, okay, this is the finished product. This is now ready to change the o-ring and ready to install. Shout out Paris Engineer Works, don't forget to subscribe and follow my page. Okay, now we have to change the o-ring uh, in the block of the fuel injection pump. Or what we call this is only uh, also uh, called the uh, pump assembly. This is a flanger and barrel. O-ring chains also. We have an o-ring uh, tree. The other side in the inside of the palm assembly. You have to be very careful. The o-ring, putting the o-ring inside the palm assembly, and also this one. You have to put the oil and check. Yeah, you have to put the oil, the barrel. And then you have to assemble it. Then check the marking. This is the what we call the rack control. We want to check the finion, put the marking so that bit easily to put the pinion and the rack control. They have a marking there inside. We have to check that one. And you have to very carefully to put back by using plus light I think it is very hard but you have to have a patient to put that one Now is in the hub marking. You have to check it is the already on the point. Very nice. You have to put the retaining ring and the spring, spring of flanger. And next one is the set spring and the flanger together and before that we have to put the oil so that it's very easy to put back the flanger into the barrel okay that one the set spring and the flanger together and 
and using flashlight you check the whole of the barrel easy easy don't push easy easy to until it going down all right then the next one you have to put the guide plunger this is the guide for the plunger then you have to check the rock control it is already going yeah you have to slowly slowly and next step you have to put the the drill no so that is very easy to go uh this going down easy easy and then it's going you have to be patient because it's very yeah slowly slowly it will go okay and then you have to put the retainer guide very nice next tip Okay, at the next step, we have to put the body. This is the body of the bug. Alright. Alright. The torque range is 55. Yeah, they are marking there. It's very slowly, slowly. All right. Next, the allen screw of the top of the barrel. No, you have to tighten that one using the torque range. Using the torque wrench so that the allen bolt is balanced. Okay, this is the shim. First, you have to put the shim. The next is the spring. Then this is the seat bulb. Then the bulb delivery and the ball together okay you have to put the ball next to the seat bulb okay this is the bulb delivery step by step then the next one is the spring spring delivery and this is the stopper delivery okay then the body bulb slowly slowly all right very nice then put the allen screw 